Hi, I'd like to introduce you to Arc, a new versioning control system with games in mind. It comes as an alternative to Perforce and Git, and its main goals are simplicity and performance. Let me show you how easy it is to get started. Arc is a single 5 megabyte executable file, which includes server, command line interface, and GUI client. Double click it to start the GUI client. When it first boots up, you'll have the option to choose a folder for a new workspace. This workspace can have content, but for now we'll just use an empty folder. The easiest way to use Arc, especially if you're testing it out, is to use a built-in server, which means that the GUI client will handle it for you. The email you enter will be your user ID. You now have a version-controlled workspace. Arc will track what happens to this workspace, and whenever there are changes, they'll appear in the Changes panel. From here, you can commit. A set of changes that is committed is called a change list. I mentioned how Arc is built with performance in mind, so here's how it looks when you drag a big project inside. This is Unreal Engine 5.2 source, with over 170,000 files and folders, just under 2 gigabytes. Whenever you have changes in the workspace, Arc will check some of the files and determine if you have local changes. Arc is incredibly fast and remains responsive throughout the process. Once you have all your changes checked summed, you can commit. Another thing that is quite important for Arc is for you to be able to see what's going on so that you can assess how long it will take to finish a certain task. If you're looking for an alternative to your versioning control system, go to arc-vcs.com and try it out. If you like what you see, please consider supporting its development by pre-ordering it. Thank you for your time, and I'll see you in the next one.